Today's topic is going to be a little bit more serious. Today we're talking about tax preparation. You can never be too prepared for taxes, uh, and it's a serious issue. And to illuminate uh, my point of emphasis on this topic, I've driven out to a jail to give you a little bit more clarity on this issue. So there's three basic phases to the preparation of taxes. And the first is the initial preparation. So phase one is initial preparation of taxes, which I'll be doing today uh, to load up for the big preparation of taxes tomorrow. Um, and that we're gonna wake up uh, first thing in the morning and get after it. Uh, and then phase three will come with the execution of the taxes. So phase one, preparation for the preparation of taxes, which is phase two, into phase three, which is execution of the taxes. And it's a very serious thing. Uh, you could stab somebody in the neck, uh, you could cheat on your taxes, and you will end up in the same place, which is the jail I'm sitting out front of right now. It's tax season. <sighs> wake up, Ray Ray. Mm. Hey, wake up, Ray Ray. It's tax season. It's important. And most business people know this. It's important that even if uh, you're not meeting with any colleagues or professional associates, uh, we won't be doing that today. Uh, but you still want to feel professional. And that means that you dress for success um, and you eat big too. Uh, so that's important. So when we get started here, we're going to um, act like this is a, a, an important, very important business meeting. Hi everyone, I'm back. Uh, so quick sort of editorial addendum, um, right as I was about to go into phase two preparation uh, of the preparation of taxes, um, one of my colleagues just stopped over. He was wanting to know about a dresser that I told him about. Um, and so I, we got to talking about it and I won't get too far into it because um, I want to do a future, pod, or a future YouTube video on negotiating. Um, so we'll leave it at that. Uh, but then we wound up at IHOP and the, that's, you know, the day kind of just got away from us. Um, so I'm just going to sort of start um, where I would have started at the, um, the business suit slow cut. So we'll just restart there. And I didn't want you to think I was like trying to pull a fast one or like back end you on the deal or anything like that. Called from a previous tutorial, uh, it's always important to have a clean workstation. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Or an undershirt. Right, right, slow down, savor it. preparation of taxes which I've done yesterday what you're going to want to do is take all the mail that has accumulated throughout the previous year uh, and you're going to want to cut that off at uh, January 1st so any mail that you receive before January 1st you're going to want to open uh, and toss what you don't need uh, and then you're going to want to separate everything else into three piles first pile bills Second pile, anything that you find with the word tax on it, you want to put in the middle pile. And then the third pile is uh, miscellaneous documents that have to be filed. So you're going to put that in the third pile, and then when you're all done, you're going to file it away in one of your um, file cabinets here. Uh, so that was the initial preparation of taxes. And now this is the uh, middle phase which is the preparation of taxes so we've got it sorted and the only thing left to do now is the execution of the taxes so for the final phase uh, the execution of taxes you're going to want to get a certified public accountant for this um, and who I tend to go with is someone I've gone with for a while uh, her name's Linda. She works for h and Block. Um, been going to her for a few years now. Uh, and this is where your communication skills, your business acumen, uh, will come into play on this. Um, so here we go. Here is the execution of the taxes. Hey, Linda, it's David again. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm, I think I got it all ready now. I know. Yeah. No, I've, I've opened it all. I've got it all separated. Um, yep, I got my taxes. I got my taxes in the manila folder, like you said. Okay. Uh, yeah, Thursday. Let me check my calendar real quick. Yeah, that should be good. Yeah. Yeah, sorry to call you so late. And you guys must be swamped, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, thank you. I appreciate it. And I'll see you then. Okay. Bye-bye. And that's it for phase three. Uh, and then you just take your taxes to uh, the executioner of your taxes uh, and they will uh, proceed from there. Now there are some, uh, some ways that uh, I make money and other people may make money that's not always connected to their job. Um, so for those cases, we're, we're probably not gonna wanna, um, we'll, We'll, for the, what we bring to the tax professional, we're just going to leave that to the stuff from our job. Uh, any outside sources of income, things like that, um, we're just going to sort of push that on the back burner for now. Um, otherwise, you're going to have to pay significantly more taxes 
um, uh, if you make them aware of that. Uh, so that's it for execution of taxes.